Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I wanted to make a little update about the whole death battle thing for, uh, you know, Superman versus Goku. Now, the whole thing about this is, like, from what I have been told is that this will be focused on Goku from Dragon Ball Super, which is, like, CC Goku, or, like, oh, I think it's, like, Capsule Corporation Goku, or I think that's what it means, versus Rebirth Superman. Now, they, they say there's, like, this is, like, a reboot, I believe, or something like a reboot of it. So, yeah, now, when I heard about this, and they said, like, oh, Goku has limits, I was like, oh, no, not Goku, uh, Superman has limits. This is going to be a problem. Now, this is what they mean, right? They're going to use Rebirth Superman. From what I heard, is it going to be Rebirth Superman, or Superman from Infinite Frontier, is, like, this fight doesn't make any more fucking sense than it already is, because, like, bro, if this, if you're using Rebirth Superman, even then, that doesn't even make any sense. That doesn't even make any sense. Rebirth Superman is really fucking powerful. If this is, like, the most, well, you know, what, most uh, canon composite version of Goku, or not, uh, Superman, I keep saying Goku, what the fuck? So, if they're using Rebirth Superman, there's, like, things like New 52, uh, the God of Strength, and then when we get just Rebirth Superman. So, this is, like, a Superman that has the many things it's like a combined version of two supermans right like having all the memories and past history stuff like that of like superman from new 52 god of strength and stuff like that so the thing about this is like we have like superman who is able to do things like oh i don't know threaten to erase the phantom zone and he was also shook it while following like characters like Rogal Zar. And we know the fans zone like is stated to exist. And for those DC fans, they know that the fans zone exists that in the fan, you know, the spear of the gods, which has innumerable dimensions within them or contains infinite dimensions. So that's like, you could say like, like hyperversal stuff like that. Like I say like hyperversal and bro, this is the fact that this this is the most impressive feat. He was able to f to destroy the World Fortress masterpiece, right? He destroyed the World Fortress masterpiece with a punch, and this is when him after you know him dipping into the sun like un unknown amounts of sun dips, right? Getting powered up. He was able to destroy the World for uh, Fortress masterpiece. And he destroyed it, right? He destroyed it. This is the World Forger exists in the sixth dimension, right? And he's able to defeat him, the World Forger, by the way. And there's this above all creation, including the spear of the gods. So you could even say that's like an outer versal. That's an outer versal Superman right here. Outer versal. But if, if even if they don't use the unknown amounts of sun dips for Superman as an amp, you could get him to like hyperversal levels. Just by him able to threaten to destroy the Phantom Zone. Like, come on now. Anyway. Um, I just wanted to let y'all know this is like an update thing, right? This is like an update thing for what what matchup this is going to be. I think, think Superman is still going to win. But we know they're going to downplay Superman a lot. And I can't wait. Just can't wait to fuck the monkey, bro. I'm going to can't wait. Can't wait. So for CC um, Goku, I don't know much about him, but I know that he is stronger than Xeno Goku. So we'll see what that goes. We'll, we'll see. So yeah, guys, that's gonna be the video. I just wanted to make a little update about that. Just that's all. So you guys have a, a lovely day. See you guys next video. Peace.